Hello, hello, hello again. So let me come on around. And as you can tell, <laughs> this is going to be my Chanel jewelry collection. So I do have other Chanel items, but this is strictly going to be uh, the Chanel jewelry that I've collected over the years. So I'm going to get right into it because I don't have very much battery life left. <laughs> ah! So I have necklaces, I have one bracelet, and a ton of earrings. So, oh, and I actually have a belt. I just got a belt. I have a belt now. Oh, no, the belt's right here. Okay. So we are going to start off with this, my one and only bracelet. Oh, and I'm sorry. I meant to say that um, I believe I'm just going to keep this as one long video, but I have my contemporary Chanel pieces. And then over to the side, I have um, my beloved vintage Ch Chanel jewelry. So this will all be contemporary. I believe everything from like the 2000s to now or to 2019, I don't have anything from 2020. And then my vintage jewelry, I have things from, I believe I have one pre-70s piece, but the majority of them are 70s and 80s and a few 90s. So let me get started again. <laughs> so this is my first item. Take this out. This going, oh, this is, and hopefully this will show. Let me just hold it up. There we go. Oops, is this gonna act right? Okay, there we go. So hopefully you can see that. That is my Chanel bracelet from the 19C uh, collection. And, oh, well, you know, I guess I can just take it out. Okay. So this is what it looks like on me, obviously. There we go. And this goes with a couple of different earrings I have. I love it. Absolutely love it. Put this bad boy back. So that's the first one. And I really I actually love Chanel packaging. There we go. And then, actually, let me go to a couple of my newest pieces. This one I just received actually a week ago. Uh, from a online site called Vineyard Vintage. And got these lovely earrings. This is from 19C as well. Hopefully those come through nicely. Cute black and white button earrings. Absolutely love them. Hoping this comes in. One of these days I'm gonna get fancier setup what I could I can actually see myself recording <laughs> but I loved it this was it came relatively quickly uh, and then I got everything the box of course you saw the tag inside and the camellia and this one I got from my beloved fashion file let me just move that to the side and I don't typically I don't mind if earrings don't have the box and all the accoutrements, but I noticed that most of the things I purchase, uh, they do come with all the good stuff. So this is a normal fashion file tag. And, oh, I love these ones. I saw these earrings on Lady Lux. I think it's Lady Lux. Uh, she goes by, she's Brandy Thomas on Instagram. I saw these on her, uh, on her uh, channel a couple years back. And I always love them. And I'm like, oh, those are so beautiful. When I see these bad boys popped up at a good price on Fashion File, child, got those immediately. So I literally just got these this week. They came in on Monday. Uh, came with the tag. Oh, this actually has a price on it. They usually cut it off. So it was $7.75. Did not pay this. I play it under retail. And which is also a rarity. But these are absolutely gorgeous. Hopefully these are coming through. Pictures are coming through nicely enough. Oh, I just love these earrings, but just got them. So I need to uh, get them authenticated before I cut off the tag. Alrighty, next up, I have a couple of button earrings. Hopefully these are coming through. And so this first set, this black and gold, these are clip on, black and gold button earrings, and this is a set of 
let's see, CC, like a, the classic sort of, uh oh, see if that's gonna come up. Okay, the classic CC earrings. So I believe I have two in my collection. I have this black and white pair, and then I have a gold pair that I'll be showing you later. So hopefully these are coming through. Mm -mm. See if I can get it together here. Put these back together. Okay, here we go. There we go. I think those show a little bit better now. Those are my two small earrings there. And then let's see what's in this one. Oh, this one's all covered up, so. Let me see. Is there anything? Oh, there is something in there. Okay. <laughs> it was so light. So I might need to take these out. There we go. These are also CC earrings. These are clip-on. Aren't they beautiful? Oh, and these are definitely like everyday sort of work or just running to the grocery store. I love these earrings. Love them, love them, love them. Okay. Alrighty, so I'll close this up. Let's see what I have next. So this next box. Oh, this is something I also got from vineyardvintage.com. And there are these beautiful dangly crystal earrings. They're so pretty. Oh, I saw them I'm like, oh, I love the floral motif. Let me see if I can get these to show together without my big old fingers being in the way, but hopefully that's coming through for you guys. Here we go. Beautiful dangly earrings. Absolutely love them. So if I haven't mentioned it, yes, Vineyard Vintage and um, let me see where else, uh, Fashion File. Uh, there's also a local jewelry store where I get a lot of my vintage from, and um, I'll discuss that when I get to the vintage side. Go, oh, and these ones, couldn't believe I got them. These are from, they're in 19 series too, but I can't remember which one. But these are the, the pearl earrings. And I think someone put the wrong price on these because I've seen them so expensive. And I want to say... These were at least 30% off, but yeah, they were gorgeous. Aren't they beautiful? I know my big old fingers are in the way. Hopefully, you'll be able to see that. These beautiful earrings. Oh. Earrings there. And then, oh, this is one of my, oh no, it's not. Oh yeah, it is. One of my first pair of Chanel earrings I ever purchased. So, two dangly earrings. This is, uh, I think, the second pair of Chanel earrings I ever purchased. Absolutely love them. I got these five, four or five years ago. These beautiful. Oh, very fancy after five earrings. And then I think I just got these about a year ago. Oh, no, no, I got these this year. I got these this year. Uh-oh. Ooh. Aren't those cute? Very cute. I mess up these pearls and be mad. Okay, then. <laughs> I mean, just in case you don't know, they're not real pearls. But, you know, they are still delicate. So, and as you can tell, these boxes for the pearl. So, show you yeah, the pearl earrings. It's not for the other one. But, you know, there was room for it. And the other set didn't come with the box, so. <laughs> okay, so I think that's it. Yeah, that's it for my earrings. And I have one belt. Go. If you follow me on Instagram, you would have already seen this. It's a chain belt. Let's see if I can get this to work. Cooperate. You can cooperate. Okay, there we go. So it's just the basic chain belt. This on the end. Let me see if I can just put it on for y'all. And I'm a 22-24. And as you know, this does not hang as much as uh, it can, but it still fits. And you do get a, hopefully this is showing through a bit of a drape. This is not the outfit to wear with it at all. But um, I've worn it with um, some sleeker, like a legging type pants 
and um, a big white shirt. And this thing, let me pull my, yeah. I have big boobs, y'all. I have to push them in to see if I can see. <laughs> so hopefully y'all can see that. So there's that. Let me take it off before I forget. So there we go. And then I have just two more pieces of contemporary jewelry pieces. There. Go. This first piece. Oh yes. Uh, I think they call it a salutor necklace. Child, y'all, let me just open box. Get the name all wrong. There we go. Oh, I have another pair of earrings in here. Oops. Hide them everywhere, y'all. <clears throat> there we go. Isn't that beautiful? Oh, I love it. And the little CCs are there. And I love that you have this rhinestone looking and hopefully this is showing love it love it love it it is heavy so this is definitely not an all-day necklace this is definitely one where you know you're gonna wear it for the evening for a little bit and then take that bad boy off <laughs> and in this case um this was a fashion file find and it came with an extra bead and this is also a fashion file find. And look at this, a pair of sterling silver Chanel earrings. I didn't even know they did that. Aren't those cute? Love it, love it, love it. They just say Chanel on them. But they're sterling silver. Beautiful. I forgot those on there already. That's necklace number one. Here is necklace number two. One up here. That's a Chanel box. And I have not quite a choker necklace, but it's something similar to it. It's a very short necklace. Let us say a short necklace. And again, this is not as logo heavy. There's the CC there, but that's drapes behind your neck. So this is very understated, but it's definitely got that Chanel look to it. But I absolutely love this. I just wore this the other day. Oh, I love it. I am looking for a pair of coordinating earrings to go with it. I don't have a pair of earrings I really love with it. Right now I just, I wear a pair of um, uh, solid gold uh, earrings with it right now. Whenever I do wear that necklace. There we go, so that was it for all my contemporary pieces. And now to my beloved vintage. Well, I guess I can put this here. Bring this on over. Hopefully this is in the way. Let's see if I can move this over. Make a little room for my babies. So this is where it all started. I started off with just vintage jewelry. And then over the last uh, maybe two years, Oh, more than that, a few years. <laughs> I've gotten into contemporary pieces, but, oh, these are two necklaces. Well, technically this is a necklace. That's a belt, but I wear it as a necklace because it does not go around my waist, y'all. But this is one from the 70s. Let me see this. And you know what? I'm sorry, this is just my video setup. I probably don't have the best close-ups. I don't have any type of editing at all, as y'all could probably know if you've seen any of my other videos. <laughs> but I love this necklace. And this is um, this is classic Chanel. So this is 24 karat or 18 karat gold plate, and I'm not sure which. But this is from the 70s. Put this here. This is a Chanel belt. I believe this is the one that was from the 90s. Ooh. It's a belt, medallions on the end. And usually, you know, you would belt it and like hook it into one of these bad boys and put it around your waist, have it dangle. Mm -mm. Does not go around my waist. Uh, let's see how far it does go. Yeah, nah. <laughs> but I do wear it as a necklace. Um, how do I wear this? Oh yeah, I think I wear it like this. There we go. So I don't know if this is coming through or not. But um, yeah, I dangle it from my neck this way. 
Oh God, I hope I'm not on camera because I am not wearing makeup, y'all. <laughs> but yeah, this is the way I wear it, that way. So it works very nicely as a necklace for me. Alrighty, so we're gonna go to the first drawer. And these are my button, vintage button earrings. These are the oldest earrings I have in my collection. These are button earrings. I don't think they get pierced at all back then, but don't quote me on that. Button earrings. And these are pre-70s, according to the stamping. Now, I'm not, you know, an expert on this at all, but oh, these are beautiful. So these are pre-1970s. Then I have a couple pieces from the 70s. It's so another pair of button earrings. It's gorgeous. And you can tell there's stamps on the inside. I don't know if it's coming through or not, but there's stamping that tells you what period the earrings are from. So another smart vintage. I really like these ones. I like the shape and that it has that poured glass. So another pair here. Do hope these are coming through. And then the pair of, another pair of button earrings with like a wood inlay. It has Chanel around the corner of it. Oh, these are just beautiful. I love these earrings. Around the corner, around the perimeter. <laughs> It says Chanel. There we go. And then I believe these next pair. Let's see. This is from the collection 23. So I believe that's 1980s, mid 80s. Another pair of button earrings. Oh, that's so pretty. And then this is a recent purchase from my uh, a local consignment shop, luxury consignment shop uh, called, uh, oh my goodness, lost my train of thought. Uh, it's called uh, Mademoiselle uh, Panache on H, but it's also uh, the uh, Mademoiselle consignment shop. I'll put in the names. Uh, when I upload this, I'll make sure to list the names uh, in the, uh, the box below. But isn't this beautiful? And I believe these are, what period is this from? This is from collection 28. So this is either late 80s or early 90s. I'm not quite sure off the top of my head. Aren't those beautiful? They're so thin. Oh. So those are, I'm just going to put them back in there. Those are my button, vintage button earrings. And then, am I missing a set? Oh no, I'm not missing a set of earrings. They're down there. <laughs> So those are all my vintage button earrings. Make sure they go back in carefully. Nice spot. Upside down. And this is my last pieces. And these are all, oh no, these aren't all dangle earrings. There's one set here. These are from the 70s according to the stamping. Oops, stamping on the back. I believe these are from the 70s. These are vintage CC clip-ons, clip-on earrings, but they're wonderful. They're so, oh, I just throw these on and like people say, it elevates any outfit. <laughs> so there's that. Then I got these fabulous earrings. I just unboxed these recently. And these are the Chanel birdcage earrings. And I've already worn them twice actually. And I wore them with like a jumpsuit, and then I wore them with a pair of jeans and a t-shirt. And I like wearing it with casual stuff, and then this makes it, you know, helps stand out. Well, it stands out either way, whatever you're wearing. <laughs> casual or fancy. But I love it. Love it. There's actually a birdcage purse out right now. Um, it was on the, uh, the runway collection. So, okay. And then these are, period, this is from. Oh, these are from the 70s as well, I believe from the stamping again, that round, I believe means that's from the 70s, possibly early 80s, but I'm pretty sure it's the 70s. Aren't these gorgeous? Aren't these gorgeous? Oh, these are one of my favorite pairs. 
favorite pairs. And it's interesting because it's from the same period. And as you can see, these are the same. Except, of course, that's a dangle pair and this is a um, stud. But love these earrings. Absolutely love them. And then this is what the back looks like. There we go. And last but not least are these Dangle CC, and these are from the 90s. Pretty sure these are from the 90s. Yep, 96. Uh-oh, a little cushion popped out. Yep, these are from 96. Aren't these cute? You know, there's a lot of those Dangle ones that are popular right now. Um, there's a skinnier part here, and they're longer. You have the big CCs at the bottom. So this is my version of it, just vintage. And a lot more affordable because can't find them in boutiques. Let me not lie, I've never been to a boutique, not for jewelry. I've been to get makeup and stuff. But you just can't find them in the boutiques and on the resale market, exorbitant, just exorbitant prices. So these are quite affordable. Well, for Chanel earrings. These beautiful. Alrighty, so that is it. That is my Chanel jewelry collection. So if you have any questions or anything, or if you want me to post some details on my Instagram account, like a close-up of a pair, just let me know. Because I know I was searching all over Instagram, excuse me, all over YouTube to find uh, earrings that I might be interested in. And sometimes the videos I would find, it would be hard to really see what the earrings really, really look like unless someone had editing capabilities. And then of course, they give you close-up shots and mod shots. But if they were like me, mm-mm. <laughs> So anyways, if there's a close-up that you want of anything, just let me know and I'll take a picture and post it on my Instagram account. Same name, Fun Lux. So that's it. This is my, my collection as of today's day. Uh, I don't have any other pieces that I'm expecting. And um, yeah, the only other thing that's coming in is a bag and it will be my first Chanel bag. And um, it's pre-loved from another local consignment shop and I'll let you guys know when that comes in. Alrighty, so that's it. Don't know how long this is, but I'm about to walk around to see. <laughs> this is in camera, but who knows, y'all. You know how I do. This is just for fun, and one of these days I'll get some editing in. <laughs> Alright, y'all, I hope you have a good one. Take it easy. Bye-bye.